fellas, it's your boy Johnny. Today we are gonna be talking about hood life. Enough! We settled this here! Let's see how you cope with Welcome to America! Yo, that's hood life, man! I'm gangster! I mean hoodie life. Look, today we're gonna be talking about how to style the hoodie. So hoodies have always been looked down upon as mm, you don't care. You look boring, look shut up man. And besides, the hoodie is actually one of the most versatile pieces that'll get you looking fly. Today I'm gonna to talk to you guys about three ways I like to style the hoodie. Y'all can shit on my swag if you want, I don't care. Just be a decent human being and watch the rest of this video. Wait, hold up, where do you get your hoodies, Johnny? H&M or Gildan ones from Amazon. And if I want uniquely designed ones, then the YouTubers I support, man. You'll stop asking me questions, bruh. So let's start off with the first way to style it and the most common way, underneath a jacket. So when getting a hoodie, I definitely recommend getting a very neutral hoodie. I'm talking about your black, your grays, your olive, your creams. Because they're so neutral, you can use them to color block very easily without even trying hard. And I would keep it oversized because the extra fabric is great for layering and is just super comfortable. So let me clarify, by jackets, I just mean wearing it under a layering piece. The most common ways are underneath a leather jacket. There's also bombers, flannels, denim jackets, overcoats. There's just something about how the hoodie flops over the collar. It's a great look and it adds layers of depth and dimensions to your outfits. And in order to pull this look off properly, focus on what the hoodie is contrasting. So for me, I like to contrast it mostly against my shoes. So if I'm wearing the bread ones, then of course I'm going to rock on the olive hoodie. And if I'm going to con- and if I'm going to- <sighs> See how many times I have to say this shit? Y'all don't know how much I have to say this shit. And if I'm going to contrast it against my black pants, then I'm probably going to wear this right here. Cream hoodie and a light denim jacket. Because both of these pieces are a lighter tone, they perfectly contrast with these dark pants. So yeah, boys, wear it under a jacket and get your color blocking on point. Next up, a very common way to style it, athleisure. So if you're gonna go down this route, I definitely recommend wearing a more fitted hoodie or a cutoff hoodie if you have those feelings of being a douche. Nothing wrong with that. Sometimes I feel like being a douche and wearing tank tops to the gym. Athletic dude athletic fit. Now this way, of course, you want to rock it as if you were about to hit them weights. So rocking them with track pants or compression pants, let's face it, those are leggings, along with shorts and a low top pair of kicks, that's the way to go. Athleisure is pretty simple. It's not my favorite way to rock a hoodie, and a hoodie's not my favorite way to rock athleisure. I'd rather be a douchebag and wear a tank top. But if you like this with the athleisure look, it's totally cool. It's super clean and super comfortable. Last but not least is another favorite of mine, individually. Now I guess you can count athleisure as wearing it individually, whatever. If you're gonna wear it individually, I definitely recommend going a little extra with your outfit. Because the hoodie is very basic, it's almost like wearing a basic crew neck shirt. So you want the rest of your outfit to make up for that basicness. And how do you do that? Well one, you can rock a different design hoodie over your basic one. So I'm talking about a branded hoodie, you know from Supreme, Kith, Champion, whatever you guys like. Since that logo stands out so much, the other parts of your outfits do not have to stand out either. Now let's just say you want to rock the basic hoodie, no logo, no unique design elements. Well, I like to rock these hoodies with accessories. And yes, this video is sponsored whenever I'm rocking a basic hoodie. I like to wear my accessories from rose gold and black. So look, rock a hoodie, basic pants, basic kicks. What's gonna tie the outfit together? Exactly, accessories. So I'm talking about your rings, your bracelets, your necklaces. If you guys wanna cop some of these fire accessories, I'm gonna put a link in the description where you guys can. The link gives you guys 25% off, man. You guys don't have to do a discount code. I don't get any commission out of it, so this ain't some shady thing. Rose Gold and Black has been a huge partner with me, and they really do support my channel a lot, and I would appreciate it if you guys support them as well, because these accessories, man, they are fire, and they really tie together any outfit, especially the basic hoodie outfit, man. If I wasn't wearing these Accessories outfit is basic and the ladies don't like basic fellas fellas and another accessory you guys can wear is a crossbody bag Of course, this is going to add another layering element to your outfit. Trust me, man I've been rocking this one and it looks amazing with my outfits. It's actually functional too, man I keep my shit in here metro card whenever I swipe super functional definitely recommend the crossbody bag and the last way to properly style a hoodie is rocking it with the right pair of pants. Oversized hoodies typically look really great with tapered pants and it's my go-to. But for me to switch it up, I really like to wear it with cargo pants that taper down along with crew socks to really show off the sneaker. It's been one of my favorite looks nowadays and trust me, I am going to make a video on how to style cargos very soon. All right, fellas, I hope this video helps you out. Hoodies are lit. Follow me on Instagram. It is Fly with Johnny Ty. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Leave your comments down below on the next type of video you guys want to see. And until then, rock these hoodies. Stay fly. I'm out. Peace.